The Americans have been fighting the ins... Barry Peterson has spent decades reporting from various points across the globe. Many have touched him. Only one story truly hit home. You're right. I'm used to telling other people's stories, and it's not been necessarily easy to say, this is my story because I'm a reporter. My job isn't to talk about my story. Um, there were two things that I really wanted to accomplish. I wanted to preserve some part of Jan. You know, if the book had sold five copies to just members of my family, that would have been fine. That part would have been accomplished. The more I went along and the more I realized what was happening with caregivers, the more I wanted to say to people, watch out. Don't let this happen to you. As I sat down with Barry, there were nerves. It's not every day you sit across from someone who is a craftsman when it comes to telling stories. Quickly, I realized this national news journalist was a husband who loved his wife and struggled with her diagnosis. Jan was diagnosed at age 55, and when you say someone is diagnosed with Alzheimer's, it's a kind of a misnomer. You're not really diagnosed, they think you have it, because they don't know for sure until they do an autopsy and they can actually see what's in the brain. Were there warning signs? Yes, in hindsight, but not signs most would pick up on. I can remember it in retrospect. At the time, I was a master of denial. Towards the end before she was diagnosed, she began to do things that are indicative of Alzheimer's. She would tell you something, and then a moment later, she'd tell you exactly the same thing. Barry lost the love of his life to the disease, and in a sense, that loss happened long before Jan died. She's very concerned about whether or not the person in the mirror is going to come with us to lunch. In an effort to honor Jan and prepare others for the long goodbye, Barry wrote this book, Jan's Story. He chronicles the journey and does his best to prepare caregivers. He only visited one place in the QCA, Senior Star on Elmore Place. He chose Senior Star because they have a special wing dedicated to memory care. You know, the real effort of this is to understand how dangerous it is to be a caregiver. And Alzheimer's is an underdiagnosed disease. Now, the Alzheimer's Association says that about five plus million Americans have Alzheimer's, but a recent study showed that doctors don't put down Alzheimer's. Old age, normal causes, heart failure, and they estimate that the number is six times higher. So we're talking about 30 million people. That's almost 10% of the American population. That's why memory care units like the one here at Senior Star are so important for the Alzheimer's patient and the caregiver. Take care of yourself, and then you can take care of the person you love. Good advice from the voice of experience. Reporting for QC Family Focus Magazine, I'm Mike Mickle.